It's time for another Come Have Coffee, a sit down with some of Cincinnati's most interesting people. March is Women's History Month, and this time I'm having coffee with a woman who is definitely making history as the first woman to hold the office of Hamilton County Prosecutor. Come Have Coffee with Melissa Powers. Now you have, uh, I don't want to say necessarily big shoes to fill, but different shoes to fill. So how is that? This, there are going to be some comparisons, you know that. Oh, absolutely. And um, obviously I could never fill the shoes of Joe. Um, I think he did an incredible job for many decades. And we, and Cincinnatians have all reaped the benefits of his work and ethic and his effort and how he ran that office um, and the, the quality of life that we all enjoy today in Cincinnati. When she's not cracking down on crime, you'll likely find prosecutor powers with a paintbrush. I'm an artist and my background started uh, in art. I love oil painting. I try to do it as much as possible. So what does that do for you? Do, I know it's some form of expression, but it, does it, is it like relaxing or tell me about that? Oh, it's definitely relaxing. It's also therapeutic and it's a creative outlet for me that I just truly enjoy and have throughout my entire life. And pretty good at it too. So I wanna dig into something that, that we, we just, just heard about. Do you like country music? Is that what I heard? <laughs> I enjoy country music. My husband really loves country music, so uh, he's introduced it to me, but we go to a lot of country music concerts. And wow, look at this. Yep, that's Garth Brooks, only one of the biggest stars in the business. Sticking with the country theme. You like a cowboy boots, huh? Okay. So you have a few pair, maybe? I do. So what does Melissa Powers care about? Well, I care about my family. I care about our community. I care about our city. I care very deeply about this office. Um, I think it was that important that I came out of retirement to take on this role in this position. A role that lands her in the history books, the first woman to hold the office. I don't think there's any additional responsibilities on me or pressure on me because I'm a female um, top law enforcement officer. We have also two other females that are top law enforcement officers, um, the, cap, the chief of the Cincinnati Police Department and also the Sheriff's Department. Isn't that something, the three of you, I mean, top law enforcement officials in, in Cincinnati, Hamilton County, are women. That's How right. How about that? That's right. I think that's remarkable and exciting and I think it signals to any girl out there, any young woman out there, you can be whatever you want to be. They are all blazing trails in law enforcement. Thank you for your service and cheers and best wishes on the journey. Coming up next week, of all the guests I've interviewed, which ones have stood out and why? That's next time on Come Have Coffee.